What is up, scent head, smell beast, and frag freaks? It's your boy. My name is Mega Dave, and this is Oh So Fresh Valentine's Day Edition. Mwah. What is up, Fresh Fam? For everybody returning, I want to say thank you so much and happy Valentine's Day. If you are brand new here, welcome. As I said before, my name is Mega Dave. This is my channel, Oh So Fresh. I do reviews on fragrances that I absolutely love, and I hope that you love them too. If you would, give me a huge thumbs up. Really means a lot. Also, think about hitting the beautiful bell down below. I would give you a million kisses. The subscription really means a lot. Hit the notification down below so you can always see when I'm reviewing new fragrances. Who knows? Could be yours that I review next. Today is a glorious Valentine's Day for you guys. I'm doing my top five fragrances from the house of Dua that I think will get you play on Valentine's Day. Just to let everybody know, this list was very, very hard for me to have to pick through and try to find my top five favorite that I thought was sexiest uh, for Valentine's. There's a whole bunch that are sexy. Your list is probably going to be different from mine, but this one is, in my opinion, the best altogether. What's going to get you action, what's going to get you lucky, what's going to get you laid on Valentine's Day. My number five fragrance that I think is the sexiest to get you play on Valentine's Day is Aphrodisiac. For those that don't know, this is modeled after Anishio's Psychedelic Love. It is a very, very gorgeous fragrance. It has some notes that are citrus, myrrh, and rose. It is, to me, a very gorgeous incense, creamy vanilla fragrance, and I'm not going to get deep into this because I have reviews for most of these fragrances or all of these fragrances actually, so links will always be down in the description, but for those that want a little quick glimpse of it, it is a beautiful creamy vanilla with some almond type of scent to it as well. It is a very gorgeous, very long lasting fragrance. It is a monster. It projects forever and it lasts forever on your skin. So that's the reason I chose it. It's going to last all night on you, and it's going to have your partner coming back for more and more of this glorious whiff. So my number five spot, Aphrodisiac. All right, rounding out, coming in at number four, a very, very gorgeous fragrance. Definitely in one of my tops. It is a very great blend. It is a hybrid, and it's none other than 44 Shades of Poseidon. For those that are new to this game, this is Creed Aventus mixed with Le Labo's Vani 44. It's essentially a very creamy vanilla with pineapple. Does it sound delicious to you? If it sounds delicious to you, imagine how it's going to smell when your partner smells it and can't keep their hands off of you. So my number four is 44 Shades of Poseidon. You're welcome. All right, coming in at number three. A gorgeous masculine rose fragrance modeled after a very, very huge superstar in the YSL, and that's none other than Tux. For those of those that don't know, this is modeled after Yves Saint Laurent's Tuxedo, which has been around for a very long time. It is highly sought after. Tux is sold out. Tuxedo is very hard to get. This is a, as I mentioned, a very gorgeous masculine rose fragrance, which you don't see a lot of. In the Dua house, there's a bunch of tuxedo iterations and hybrids that I could have chose from, and they're all great, but I went with the classic that started it all, and I think, in my opinion, the classiest, straightforward, gorgeous scent to get you play on Valentine's Day. Some of the main notes are bergamot, rose, lily of the valley, vanilla, and patchouli. It really, really is a very high class, sophisticated scent for a gentleman that is very well groomed and going to a sit down reservation only restaurant. You want to exude confidence and you want to exude wealth and class and sophistication. This scent is for you. In my opinion, the Casino Tux, the Poseidon's Tux, they all are fantastic, but the scent profile on this that started all of it is such a classic and timeless scent that you definitely can't go wrong. It is extremely high quality. It lasts forever. It's going to do you justice 
This is definitely for a more mature man, but if you're younger and you wanna exude that class and that sophistication and that elegance for a gentleman, this is gonna be for you. This is gonna take you from your restaurant back into your limo, back to your high-rise condo, and it's going to lead to places that you could only dream of. So, in my number three spot, do us tux. <laughs> Coming up in my number two spot, this is a very, very elite section. There's a lot of scents that could have been put in this place. This top two, especially number two and number one, were extremely, extremely hard for me to pick. But ultimately, I made the decision, and I think I made a very good one. Number two is arguably one of the best date night fragrances out there. It's an expression from a vintage formulation from 2010, Midnight Rendezvous. This fragrance, for those that don't know, probably isn't too many people out there, but it is a gorgeous cardamom bomb that just oozes sexuality and seduction. This is definitely one of my all-time favorites for date night before I knew about Dua. This was one of my go-tos if I was going to a very nice place or meeting a new woman or a new girl or whatever it may be. This was definitely one that I put into rotation quite a bit. And if you saw my Midnight Rendezvous review, you know I used to spray this on the pillows of my lovers at the time, and they would compliment me and send me messages telling me that they could still smell me. And it's such a great, great fragrance. Dua did a fantastic job of replicating that 2010 version. This thing absolutely lasts forever. This is such a pure, sexy fragrance that will have your partner remember your smell even if they can't remember your name the next morning so my number two spot for the fragrance that's going to get you play on valentine's day midnight rendezvous all right it's number one time there can only be one and this is my favorite my absolute favorite in the entire fragrance catalog from dua it is stuff that whispers are told of. It's a legend in the community. Everybody loves this fragrance. I don't find any person that doesn't love this fragrance. It is started from the bottom and now it's here. <laughs> it is everybody's top 10, everybody's top five, probably everybody's top three, and it's probably what you already think of. So my number one fragrance to get you play on Valentine's Day, Casino Elixir. For those that don't know, this is a cross between Creed Aventus and MFK's Baccarat Rue 540 x -Straight. So people were already layering this way before uh, they did this back in 2017 or 18, I believe. But he just kind of did it even better. He picked the notes out, and I'm not going to get too in-depth. Probably everybody has seen my review for Casino Elixir. If you haven't, it'll be down in the comments. But it is such a beautiful marriage of two that people already loved and superstars in the fragrance community blended them together and made an absolute blockbuster of a fragrance that I think is the best in their house. The notes, pineapple, apple, saffron, almond, amber, patchouli. It is gorgeous. It is long lasting. It is filling the room scent bubble time it is great on the skin it is lover central it is everything that you love in a fragrance together it is sweet it is seductive it is long lasting the sillage is gorgeous it is mass appealing you will get compliments you will get people that are falling head over heels literally in love with you for wearing this fragrance to me there is none sexier and more appealing than Casino Elixir. This works well in all climates, I would say, except for extremely, extremely high heat. So if your Valentine's date is outside walking on the beach in the middle of the sun on a 100 degree day, maybe don't go for this choice. But otherwise, if you're going out, it does not matter where you're going. It's classic. It is sophisticated. It is fun. It is flirtatious. It is seductive. And it is my number one spot to get you play on Valentine's Day. It is none other than casino elixir as always everything will be down in the description all my reviews links to purchase all of these bottles if they are in stock will be down below but that's what i got for you that's my top five from dua to get you play on valentine's day let me know in the comments what your top five are let me know what your favorite fragrances are tell me where you're going for valentine's day i'd really like to know i love you guys as always i hope everybody has a 
beautiful, beautiful Valentine's Day. Get lots of flowers, get lots of mm, lots of kisses and hugs and love and rubs and tugs and all that jazz. I just hope everybody is enjoying themselves. If you are single, get you a beautiful bottle and snuggle up next to it. It'll love you forever, I promise. Until I see you guys again, be blessed. Stay fresh. We got we shorties on the flow. We got we niggas by the bar. We got we got.